Welcome back. They are asking me to find the coordinates of the midpoint of the line segment joining the following two points. Which is a very long sentence, by the way. Now, in a previous video, I have explained how you can calculate that and why. Yeah? But now, these are two example questions for you to test if you really understand. Yeah? So, question A. What is the coordinate of the midpoint of the line segment connecting these two points? 5, 6 and 1, 2. Yeah? And question B. What is the midpoint yeah, of the line segment connecting these two points, minus three, minus three, and minus one, five? And really do yourself a favor, put it on pause before you continue. So the first question is, what is the midpoint of the line segment connecting these two points? And I've said in a previous video um, that to find the x-coordinate, you simply do five, plus 1, so you add the two x-coordinates of the two points, and then you divide that by 2, you take the mean, if you like, at the average, 5 plus 1 is 6, divided by 2, the x-coordinate of my midpoint is 3. And I say you simply do it like this, however, I really urge you to make sure that you understand why we are adding the two x-coordinates and dividing it by 2, yeah? That has got to do with the drawing I made in my previous video. Anyway, to find the y-coordinate of my midpoint, I add the two y-coordinates, 6 plus 2, and I divide those by 2. 6 plus 2 is 8, divided by 2, and that is 4. Now, just to make sure I didn't mess my x's and y's up, x is 5 plus 1, uh, x the first one, yeah, and y is 6 plus 2, yep, yeah. yeah, because sometimes all of a sudden people start uh, uh, confusing themselves, oh, what was x, what was y, yeah? It's x and the second one is y. Okay, I've done that properly. So the coordinate of my midpoint is 3, 4. So that is the answer to my first question. Now the second question, um, yeah, so the same question, only two different coordinates, minus 3, minus 3, minus 1 and 5. And I will calculate it first and I will show you graphically uh, that I'm right. Okay, so the x coordinate is minus 3 plus uh, minus 1 divided by 2, uh, the x coordinate of my midpoint. Minus 3 plus minus 1 will be minus 4 divided by 2, which is minus 2. And the y coordinate of the, my midpoint will be minus 3 plus 5 divided by 2. Minus 3 plus 5 is 2 divided by 2, and that is 1. So the answer of the midpoint yeah, of the line segment connecting these two points, yeah, and again, that's a very big and long se sentence to understand, but anyway, the answer is minus 2 and 1. And I just want to show you graphically that that is really the case, yeah, that, that that is correct. Again, I've explained all of this in the previous video. But just to show you, what did I do? I These are the two coordinates of the question. Minus 3, minus 3. So minus 3, minus 3. So that is one coordinate. And the other coordinate, minus 1, 5. Minus 1, 1, 2, 3, 4. That's the other coordinate. And I drew the line segment, as you can see. And then I turned it into a right angle triangle. Okay? And then I said, okay, um, horizontally how many boxes is it it's one two boxes so what lies in the middle what is the midpoint there that's after one box so that will be here and vertically how many boxes how many steps is it that's a one a two a three a four a five six seven eight so what is in the middle of eight that is four steps so from here one one two three four over there or if you would have gone from here one, two, three, four over there. So I, with a little arrow, I've said, okay, those are my midpoints yeah, of the horizontal side and the vertical side. So what is the midpoint of my line segment? So that's going to be here, yeah, that is where they meet. Okay, so that indeed is at minus two, one. And that is exactly what I calculated, minus two, one. Okay, I hope that was helpful, otherwise you make sure to leave me a message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. All the best.